Pakistan's interior minister has lashed out at the United States for the drone attack which killed Taliban leader Hakimullah Massoud. Chaudhary Nizar Ali Khan said the U.S. strike was an attack not just on an individual, but on the Pakistani government's entire attempt at peace talks with the militant group. Brick by brick in the last seven weeks, we tried to evolve a process through which we can bring peace to Pakistan. And what have you done? You have scuttled it on the eve of the day, or one day before, 18 hours before, a formal delegation of respected ulema or religious leaders was to fly out to Miran Shah and hand over this formal invitation. Pakistan has said its relations with the U.S. will now come under full review. Cricket legend turned politician Imran Khan, meanwhile, has announced that NATO supplies will be barred from passing through the KPK province ruled by his party until U.S. drone strikes on Pakistani soil are stopped. The attack, which killed Masood and took the lives of three others, took place in the militant stronghold of Miran Shah in northwest Pakistan. Masood was buried in secret and is believed to have been replaced by the organization's number two, Khan Saeed, who is suspected of involvement in a number of terror attacks over the last several years and is said to have masterminded an attack on a jail in northwest Pakistan that freed nearly 400 prisoners in 2012. The Taliban has promised a wave of suicide bombings as revenge for Massoud's death. In response, Pakistan has stepped up security in the northwest of the country and especially in the city of Peshawar.